sun moon and rising I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the support that you have been giving me I'm so grateful this is the 48 week of the year 2017 this week is an hurt week um, this is the fifth week of the month of November this is the last and fifth week of November 2017 and um, in this week you have and the zodiac energy of fire okay but the zodiac energy of fire this is really a week where you are going to see um, situations happening and um, a lot of changes happening also in your life okay I'm putting on my glasses because these cards are really one of you have a situation to deal with the king of Pentacles the king of Pentacles can be the energy vibration of a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn so this person could be over the age of 35 okay so this is going to be your focus with dealing with this person and um, this energy that is coming in to deal with this person is not going to be one of the most easiest energies but we are going to look to see whatever else is going to transpire in your week in your week you have the um, the uh, on Monday the energy of uh, um, on Monday you have the energy of the, th the, the the Empress the Empress is good because it's the earth week the Empress is coming in the Empress is trying and this can be a Capricorn person who's coming in but uh, the, uh, this person is coming in to help you um, to 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 manage your materialistic situation okay Tuesday is a water energy the energy of the hangman so you're you know you are looking for inner guidance from within you're looking to find out inner guidance for within um, the crowning of your week is temperance which is the energy vibration of this week so this is wonderful so the crowning of your week is temperance is finding in a balance is finding balance with everything around you it is the energy of temperance that is holding you grounded in this week so this week is going to be a very grounded week for you because you're an air sign and the week is the week of the temperance and the temperance comes back to help you guys Thursday is going to be one of your best days. They're going to be justice, justice. So this is so good. Um, this is your best day because your own energy vibration comes up for you Librans to work with on Thursday. So Thursday is going to be your best day. Friday, you have the energy of the eye princess coming in. And for a lot of you hair sign people, the Empress and the Eye Princess have been coming up in this week in your readings, whatever the situation is, whatever is transpiring in your life, um, the mother nature of uh, um, your intuition and your earthly needs, your material um, help, the mothers are coming in to help you and these are the major arcana. So as I look at your reading, you Libras, you have the major arcana most of Monday to Friday the major arcanas are here so this is a, going to be a powerful reading I have been receiving powerful readings from you air signs um, so let's look at Saturday and see what is happening um, if on Saturday a situation you have the three of swords in the reverse so if you had heart broke if you are heartbroken about something in your life you need not to worry about this because whatever is happened and whatever heart broke you heart, heartbreak you had um, this is going to be over this is going to be healed okay it could be a heartbreak from the king of Pentacles because that is the focus that is who um, the focus of the king of Pentacles can be a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and you could have an art break over that person but yet still it is going to be good okay the other energy that you have is the energy vibration of the four of swords in reverse so whatever um, arguments that was happening whatever that was imbalanced in your life you are going to realize that this situation is going to be healed and this is going to be very good whatever that has transpired it's going to be ill and this is going to be positive okay this is going to come up in a very very positive way for you okay um i'm looking because i think um i think my battery is about um 
I need to charge my phone so I really really don't want to stop this video because I've been having problems since I'm doing this on my phone I really need to get these out people I need to get these situate these readings out so here I'm still here don't worry I'm still here because I'm trying to get you guys the best possible um, energies out here try to figure out if I can take it from this way which if I bring the camera in here see I'm not letting you go hey just not letting you guys go of course <laughs> Okay, but I'm still going to figure out a way to do this. Okay. All right. Um, let me just charge and come back. Okay, we're back. <laughs> With the NG of what happened there. Okay, so we did, we went through, yeah, we did went through <clears throat> the energies for your week. So okay let's see what is going on here i gotta break the time in so let's see what is going to um, be affecting your weeks your days in this week okay so let's see for the empress what is she coming with the tower she's bringing down the tower with the angman the two of pentacles is coming in with the temperance, you have the king of pentacles that is going to affect you. Justice, prince of cups. This is good. Okay, let's see for Friday, the eye princess. You have the prince of wands in reverse. Um, whatever the situation was, you're seeing clearly a situation you're seeing clearly now. And you have delusion which the delusion you're seeing clearly because the um, energy of the icons and then you have for the king of pentacles you have the four of swords you are resting from whatever situation that has transpired in your life okay so a lot of help is going to come in for a lot of you so if you were experiencing certain situation in your life a lot of help is going to come into you so okay let's look at Monday we have a hurt energy it is the energy of the week on Monday we have a hurt energy we have the energy of um, um, the um, Empress the energy of the Empress is coming in with the energy of the tower this is good this is wonderful because whatever that was blocking um, your materialistic effect it is going to be broken down a lot of people is falling away whoever that was blocking your way whatever situation that was transpiring on Monday you're going to see that the energy of this Empress comes in and removing it on Tuesday you have the energy of the hangman you're looking within you're trying to figure out how you're going to be balancing your financial situation it is a time where you need to take inner guidance and inner balance with certain aspect of yourself you are trying to balance out certain situation it's the end of november and you're wondering how your situation is going to be healed if you're going to have enough for the christmas and you're taking the time to look within on tuesday um the crowning of your week you have temperance and it is temperance with someone the king of pentacles the king of pentacles is here twice so a lot of you have a situation to deal with the Taurus Virgo and Capricorn he is um, the um, crowning of your week but he's also the focus of your week because he comes back here this is the focus of your week and the focus of your week you need rest from this king of pentacles okay and he is the crowning of your week so you need to have in a lick um, inner passion and guidance with this um, king of uh, pentacles because he seems to be um, on balance okay and you need to find the balance to balance him out Thursday is going to be one of your best day because Thursday you have your own energy vibration 
and Thursday the Prince of Cups comes in the Prince of Cups could be someone younger than you who is a Pisces um, a cancer or a Gemini Pisces cancer or Gemini so this king of cups is coming in this is going to be wonderful whatever that has transpired between you and this king of cups there is going to be balance and there is going to be a positive ending with you and this king prince of cups so this is going to be good okay as we <coughs> sorry move forward <coughs> my excuses on Friday we have the eye princess another water energy a water energy um you're getting intuition guidance about this prince of wands this is someone who's young so this is going to affect you and your kids because maybe information is coming from your spirit guides about your kids about something that is happening in your life and it affects your kids or it affects someone who is a leo a leo a Aries or a Sagittarius okay it could be someone um, whatever is happening this person is not really honest and um, you are seeing um, something playing out about that person because he, he was not really honest and that is um, true okay whatever has transpired in your life okay whatever has transpired in your life on saturday you have the three of swords in reverse okay the three of swords in reverse so if you had an art break over your financial situation and uh, um your materialistic things and so you have an art break over it the two of swords is coming in you're going to see clarity um, and this clarity is going to come in to help you to understand what it is you need to do okay what is this you need to do and how you're going to be dealing with this situation and know what is good for you and what is the best next options to take in your life so clarity is coming in for you on Saturday on Sunday there is disillusion this disillusion has to do with the four of swords there's hash words hash um, things and information coming towards you you're disillusioned by um, situations that has happened in your life you're very um, you're feeling in the dissolution with yourself so for you Librans there's going to be a lot of stuff that is happening to you in this week because there is a strong feelings of dissolution it's a week where um, things are not happening for you okay there is a week where things are not happening for you let's see um, what is happening um, with this disillusion this four of sword and this disillusion what is happening um, for some of you men it's going to be happening for you that you're not um, you're not seeing something that is happening um, you had an art break or it was as if you know someone that you were depending on has let you fall alongside the way because if you're looking at this is that you men are having disillusion this disillusion comes on the four of sword the four of sword is that there um is a, a time for resting period you know the resting is not here you are broken from something and disillude from something that transpire in your life so it's affecting there is a dissolution which is affecting you with a man it's as if um you're not seeing clearly something it's as if your energy vibration is out is is out you know you're not really um it's as if you're not really heartbroken because you see the truth of the situation but yet still um you're in disillusion because as you look you're trying to figure out yourself for you ladies it is you have a heartbreak and you're dissolute over a guy it's as if you're keep on holding on to this man and you need to let go and release this man I want to know who is this king of um, this 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 king of Pentacles is actually a good friend this is wonderful because this this king of Pentacles is coming in as a good friend and this is someone if you um, 
if you you if you haven't met this king of pentacles it's actually someone who is coming in as a very good friend who is going to help you out okay so as i am looking at your week because that was you know information that was questions that i have about who is this king of pentacles because this king of pentacles um came up twice in your reading it came up as your focus and you need to you know have rest with this person this person could be someone who you connect with and it's a very very good friend there is love there's a lot of love if you look at your energy of this reading there is a lot of love there's powerful love that you're having with this um <clears throat> the men are having a powerful epiphany you had felt hurt about something okay and um, this could be someone who has the energy vibration of um, an Aquarius, a Libra, uh, an Aquarius or a Gemini. OK, and there is a disillusion about you and this person because um, you felt heartbroken, but yet still you're not seeing the truth of the situation. So this is hanging out for you men. And, you know, the king of pentacles that is coming up is actually somebody who is very good, who is actually here to help you. It's, it is a good friend, this king. This king of pentacles who is here is a very good friend because he he's going to affect most of you because it can be a Taurus, a Virgo or a Capricorn. But this is someone who is about to come in your life. Maybe they're already in some of um, in some of your lives. And this is going to be good. Whatever Illy um, um situation you had to dealt with, with the Prince of Cups, the Prince of Cups is someone who is um, uh, um, um, a Pisces, a Cancer, a Pisces, a Cancer, or a, a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpion? Um, this is good. There's justice. There's balance, which is good. So this is a very, very positive. This could be that you're connecting whatever that was unjust between you and your child or as someone who is younger than yourself, because this is justice for some of you. It's going to be a relationship that you had with this person, or it can be something that transpire um, with you. This is going to be good because what is happening is that the balance between you and this Prince of Cup is coming in, and there's great love. There is great love that is happening and it could be affecting you. So look and see who is it that is um, a Pisces, a Cancer or a Scorpio. Because whatever is happening, there is a connection. This love that is coming in is powerful from this person. And it could be a child. It could be that you're in a relationship. It could be... Um, because what is happening here love is here so it's not really it is as if maybe this child was taken from you and justice bring this child back to you maybe um you could not see this child for a while but justice has bring this child back to you this is your child that sort of a situation that is happening um whoever this the king king of um pentacles is this person is a good friend this person is here for you in this week through thick and thin whatever that was blocking because the tower comes because whatever that was blocking your materialistic thing is it's going to heal it's going to be opening up things are going to be happening for you as I look at your reading, there is a lot, the number three energies. You need to work with the Ascendance Masters in this week for most of you. You need to work with the Ascendance Masters. You have number three and number four. Um, the four is you're bringing a certain balance to your life. You have the four of swords door. So be, be aware. The four of swords is really that you're bringing balance in your life. You have the four of swords here and you have the four of swords there, which is uh, extremely good. Um, whatever you're saying to this king of pentacles, this is going to help you to heal a situation and bring balance in your life. Because here again, you have... Uh, a temperance and this is as if this man this king of pentacles 
who is a very good friend to a lot of you people is helping you to bring balance in your life which is going to be wonderful okay the sun energy is going to come out there is going to be a healing the sun energy is going to come out whatever that has transpired there is going to be a healing the energy of the sun is going to come out this is a success that is coming to some of you do not be array or disarray about the things that are happening in your life okay all right um if there's any more messages um let me know but you know good people good friends good partnerships good people are going to be coming in your life whatever that has transpired in the past it's going to be whatever the dissolution you men are having let it go let it go okay ask the universal angels to come and take this disillusion from you okay let's see because we're working with angel for the answers and let's see what are you libras having and let <laughs> okay all right i guess my guides and angels are letting me hear that they hear thank you let go people let go stop uh, arboring hatred jealousy um, let go of whatever it is that you are dealing with you know call upon the angels and guides and say I'm delivering you this situation please because I can no longer deal with it let go of this situation whatever you men are going through whatever delusion that you men are going through ask the angels and guide for a little help to help you out of this situation it is really a strange week and um, yeah, the crystal ascension crystal ascension I am attuned to the universal wisdom and energy of the crystal kingdom um, this is a wonderful energy to have um, the crystal healing is coming back on this planet call upon um, Lady Nadia Lady Nada helps um, with the crystal energy to bring back on this planet. Um, for you men, you need to let go and call upon the angels and guides before you go to sleep and ask them to take you to crystal planet so that you can have healing. You don't have to be a crystal child or an indigo child. Anyone can go to the crystal planet for healing. So again, it is saying I'm attuned to the universal wisdom and energy of the crystal kingdom ask your angels and guides um, ask Archangel Michael for protection and ask your angels and guides to bring you to the crystal planet for healing I want to say um, to each and every person no matter what is happening in your life in this week know that there is a plan for everything we need to understand this we need to know and be aware I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back please like share these videos thumbs up remember to go back and listen every week for the next week because this is the last week of November um, go back and listen um, to the monthly reading and I'm saying please like share these videos thumbs up um, share these videos on the website share these videos please like and share these videos and I want to say I love you so much I will speak to you next week Oh,